Hi there, it's Cathy here and today I'm joined by Rachel Flower, who is a multi-passionate entrepreneur who works mainly with female entrepreneurs and Rachel's kindly agreed to give a little bit of feedback after having completed my transformational tarot program and um once you know just in case this can help you if you're curious about making some breakthrough or shifts in your own life I'm wondering how coaching with tarot might support that then you might learn something from Rachel's experience today so hi Rachel it's lovely to have you with me thank you so much for coming and being happy to share some of your experiences it's my pleasure Kathy thanks for inviting me brilliant so um what was it that made you curious about doing the program? What made, what was it that um, made you sign up for it? Well, during uh, December 2022, um, you were doing a Advent series. So every day into my inbox, because I was on your list, I was getting um, a, a five or, or ten minute tarot reading and you were sharing a card for that day and a message. And um, as it started popping up in my inbox, I just started, oh, that's interesting, and clicking on them and just instantly fell in love with them. Um, I thought the readings that you did were really powerful. And even though they were for everybody because they were going out to your list, they really spoke to me and helped me to take a, a moment and reflect and think about where I was. And the second part of your question, well, where was I? Well, I was incredibly busy. I was running three to four different businesses. I've got two young children. And, you know, with hindsight, I was pretty burnt out and I was heading into the Christmas season. And um, I think now really just serendipitously, I started getting these tarot readings and they really forced me to stop and ask myself some difficult questions about like, literally what am I doing with my life? How am I spending my time? Am I happy? Am I on purpose? Uh and then I guess the really important question was, am I really listening to my own intuition? Because the process of listening to you doing the readings made me stop and say, what do I really want? And am I uh, stuck on the hamster wheel of life or am I taking time to reflect and, and ask those meaningful questions? So then at the towards the end of December, when you launched the transformation program, it was, it was a bit of a no brainer for me. I'd had such a great experience um, during December, just, you know, kind of sharing a free content. I thought, well, the paid content is going to be amazing. Let's let's jump in. And so it was a real no brainer for me to dive into the program. Oh, that's wonderful. What what did you um, how was it for you, actually, when we when we did the one to one coaching sessions with the cards? What was that like for you with the actually going through that process? Can you describe that for other people who might be curious? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm really quite a beginner in tarot. I'm curious about it. I'm intrigued, even more so now having been through the program. But I didn't really know what to expect. So when you started doing in that first session, the spreads and starting talking about, you know, this is your current situation. This is where you've come from. This is where you're going. These are some advice cards like um, the space that is then created to, to sort of say, well, what does that mean when I apply it to me and my personal situation? And um, because it's more like a coaching interactive experience, um, previously, if I have dabbled with tarot readings, they felt a bit one way, like I've just been one way traffic of information. This was very much felt like more like a two way process where there was then space to stop and say, okay, that's what the cards are saying, but what's your interpretation of that? How does that make you feel? And I think that's when this really powerful, intuitive reaction for the individual comes in because the space is created to uh, have, you know, a reaction essentially to what the cards are delivering. You said before when we were chatting earlier that um, it had helped you kind of find some parts of yourselves that the self that you hadn't been expecting to see come up in the sessions can you say a little bit more about that yeah completely so I think that space that I just referred to when you've you've looked at the cards together and then 
uh, things appeared for me, whether that was like thoughts or emotions. Um, and I've used the word unbidden, um, you know, like caught me by surprise and expected. And it might be, you know, memories from the past or it might be dreams that I'd been harboring, but had pushed down and not given any time to. Or it might be um, fears and doubts that I had about uh, my own capabilities or the potential that I had to achieve certain things and they they came by surprise and I think that's the magic of the experience for me is that this isn't something I could have done on my own um, with the tar cards or otherwise you know I think it's the, the combination of a safe coaching space with the quite magical tools that the tarot provides us and then allowing me as an individual the, the time and the space to allow these emotions and these thoughts to come up. And some of them genuinely, yeah, were things that I'd not thought about for years. Um, and it became emotional in parts, definitely, and continued to, to be so in the week after we'd met, you know, so in between sessions, I had to go away and kind of process and reflect and think about why I was having these thoughts or these emotions and, and really forced me to unearth them and investigate them and open what can be a Pandora's box, I think, but in a gentle, in a gentle, what felt gentle and safe. Fabulous. What, what was it that you most enjoyed about the whole process? Um, I obviously I enjoyed working with you because uh, you're such a wonderful, caring, kind, compassionate person and so much integrity. And, you know, it felt like a very honest and uh, safe process to be part of. And, and that's an amazing experience, particularly in the kind of the wild west of coaching that exists today. So, you know, I would definitely say, um, you know, if you're thinking about working with Kathy, please, please do. She's a really trustworthy and um, somebody that you can that that you can um, really feel safe with. So that's been a wonderful experience. Uh, but also, I think there's something very powerful, obviously, when you invest in a program like this, and you invest not just the money, but also the time and the message to yourself that you're worth it. You know, you're worth uh, stopping and reflecting and tuning into your intuition and questioning what you're doing with your life and what your potential is, or maybe questioning relationships or you, you know. I think as busy women in particular, we tend not to make that time for ourselves. So it was really valuable for me to have that in my diary with you, like as a non-negotiable commitment. And then, as I say, uh, the, the byproduct of that was that it wasn't just the time we spent together, but the ripple effect of what happened as a result of the sessions or what changes I started to make or how I started to show up differently. And um, it's just been incredibly valuable. Um, transformational as the title says <laughs> was there anything specific that you noticed changing in life what sort of did did you have breakthroughs or um that that you were aware, really aware of or like clear decisions that you were able to make or things that you dropped or what what specific things might this be useful for do you think for other people based on your experiences I mean, they've been massive for me. Um, you know, as you mentioned, I'm, I'm you know, a multi-passionate entrepreneur. So at the time we started working together, I'm operating four businesses, I've got a lot of plates in the air, a lot of commitments, a lot of responsibilities. And uh, being in the program forced me to stop and take stock and ask those difficult questions about where am I really putting my focus? Where do I really want to have an impact? How do I really want to show up in some of these relationships and these commitments that I've got? And um yeah, I've, I've been shedding and changing direction and literally that I've had and very important conversations with investors and employees and clients. And like it's had a it's had a, an impact across nearly all areas of my life, I would say. Um, and, and it's back to that, you know, we have all of this inside of us. We have this incredible potential inside of us. Like it's there, but it's often kind of stagnant, stagnant or dormant. So I guess what the process and the program allowed us to do together is stir up that whole pot, you know, and really put energy and, and passion behind some of the things I was already working on, but, but, but at, with laser focus. And that's mm. where I'm at, at the moment. You know, it's been quite a quick fire. You know, six weeks is not a long time for us to work together, really. So I'm still kind of riding the waves of, of what we've started to create. And I'm sure the outcomes are going to be, you know, tenfold um, 
potentially even a hundredfold, you know, in a year's time as I take some of that that into force. I just I just really lost my way before we started working together. I was tired and uh, frankly pissed off and demotivated by lots of external things, not just in my own businesses, but things that were going on in the world. And I think literally the act of being in the program, taking that time every week has allowed me to tune into my own uh, power and potential and get back get back into um into gear again it's been wow. fantastic that sounds amazing I'm so excited for what you're going to move into in the future with with your new program the greenhouse and how that's going to impact other women it's very exciting so I do hope you keep me posted about it um one last question would you recommend this to others and why if so a hundred percent and you know I've already shared a couple of reasons like you're just an absolute joy to work with and so passionate about what you provide but also so knowledgeable and you know I felt really safe working with you um and I just also say you know I think if if I'm like I was like a beginner in in tarot so it's been like a bit of a baptism of fire and I've learned so much but I anticipate that someone that's more experienced would still have an equally transformational experience with you because it's uh, you know it's about that co- that coaching element as well I just found that so incredibly powerful I think you're a really great coach and it's probably because you care so much as well but this word safety that I keep using you know, I would really recommend people to come and put their trust in you and and just see what happens. They'll be well looked after, I'm sure. Wow. Thank you so much, Rachel. And thank you for coming to share your thoughts and insights today. I really, really appreciate it. So thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> but the, all the thanks are from me. It's been an amazing experience. I've loved every minute of it. It's been transformative. So thank you. It's been been fantastic. <laughs>